Hello my friends and welcome back to the rabbit hole and welcome to a very fun video today. We are looking at micro dart patches under a microscope. Today's video is sponsored by Cure. We are going to be looking at the Cure micro infusion targeted patches specifically. Oh, I'm so excited. Now we got to start with the basics here in case you clicked on this video and you're going, what are micro dart patches, Alice? Think of these as somewhat an in-between of something like, mm, say, a hydrocolloid, acne patch, and microneedling. These are indeed patches that have dissolvable needles in them. And why on earth would we do this? Well, keep in mind that our skin is a barrier, and a lot of ingredients are just a little bit too large to penetrate past our epidermis. So the idea with these dissolvable needle patches is that it helps to get these ingredients deeper into your skin. And in the case with ingredients like hyaluronic acid, this would help with having a plumping effect even deeper in your skin. And with that explanation, I'm sure you're not at all surprised to see that Cure chose sodium hyaluronate as the first ingredient in their microinfusion targeted patches, but they don't stop there. Because these are patches where they encourage the use of them anywhere on your face, we also have some depuffing caffeine. That's a great ingredient for that puffiness that can happen underneath your eyes. We also have copper tripeptide 1. That is a very popular anti-aging ingredient, which I have an entire video about. We have brightening and evening, niacinamide, modecasoside, which I feel is such a smart addition to these patches. That is one of those soothing ingredients found in Sika. That is joined by soothing allantoin and centella asiatica extract, of course. We have retinol, as you all know, retinoids are one of the most studied families of ingredients for the purposes of anti-aging. We have soluble licorice extract, another brightening ingredient, and finally, acetylhexapeptide 8. That is a hydrating peptide that may possibly do a lot more for your skin. So you can see how when you have all of those ingredients loaded onto these micro dart patches, you get a lot of different benefits no matter where you place these on your skin. You get brightening, you get smoothing, you get depuffing. And needless to say, it is also extremely easy to use these. All you have to do is make sure you have clean skin, slap them on. Personally, I do kind of press them into place and then I sleep with these on. And because you are getting those ingredients delivered deep into your skin, you will probably see results very quickly, if not overnight within merely a few patches. And now for my fellow curious minds, if you are like me and you have been thinking, mm, what do these dissolvable needles look like the entire time? We are going to be answering that question exactly today. Please do not do this at home. Not that I really think any of you would, but just as a heads up, I'm pretty sure we are going to destroy these in the process of uh, figuring out what they look like under a microscope. You use them, I'll do the curiosity deep dive over here, okay? So I'm opening up one of these patches in a box. You get eight of these pairs. And here's what the patches look like. You can see the size up against my face. And what I'm gonna be doing, and I'll have this up on the screen for you, is I'm holding these patches directly under the microscope. This is kind of gonna give us a top-down view. Oh my goodness, do you see this? Do you see all of these little dots? That's the micro darts. But it is a top-down view, so I feel like uh, we're not getting the chance to see them in that kind of needle shape. However, that is fascinating. There's so many on here. I guess this makes sense, as Kira does say there are 80 of these dissolvable needles. So I'm trying to angle this microscope next so we can uh, see these we got the needles. Oh my gosh, this is, it's so hard for me to hold this steady. So I'll probably uh, freeze frame it for you so you can see it better. But yes, wow, we are actually looking at the dissolvable needles. They, they look like little icicles. I'm actually bending these now. I feel like I feel like I might have accidentally crushed some of these. Again, these are, uh, this particular patch is not usable anymore, but it's 
for the sake of science. You can actually see your girl has a, a squished a few of these. I want to try one more experiment with these. I have the other patch from this package, and I'm going to go ahead and put that on my skin. I don't know if you can tell, but I have some makeup on the bottom of my face, not my forehead, because I knew I wanted to try this. This is my favorite place to put these patches. I have never had Botox, and uh, you know, it is true that it's very hard not to frown at the world. <laughs> so that is my favorite part of my face, to plump. Wait, how am I gonna do this? <laughs> I have the patch on, but this is gonna be, this is, this is the wrong angle. I think I'm gonna have to peel the patch off in order to see the needles dissolving into my skin. Right? This makes sense, I think. We are now joined by an assistant over here. Sorry, I can't see you at all, but that's okay. <laughs> all right, so we're pulling these off kind of early. I just want to see the impact in my skin. Oh, I feel like we can actually see that some of them have already dissolved and some of them haven't. But yes, for reference, you should leave these on for a couple of hours, and this is kind of exactly showing you why. Wow, look at that, you can actually see them coming right out of my skin. Well, my friends, I think we accomplished exactly what I set out to do. How interesting was this? I feel like I will forever be over here thinking about how these look like icicles. <laughs> Big thank you again to Cure for working with me on this video. I will go ahead and link the website below. By the way, for a limited time, you can get the patches plus their microneedling system at a bundle discount. As I mentioned in a past video, I was always going to tell you when that happened, and it is happening. But that's it for today's video. If you enjoyed, make sure to like and subscribe. I hope you all have a wonderful rest of your day, and I will see you all next time.